Hello, we will discuss next the following nonlinear optimization problem. Find the local extrema of the function f defined on r squared minus the point zero zero with values in r f of x, y given by x, y plus 8 over x plus 8 over y. The standard procedure is to find first the critical points. These critical points are to be found by solving the system of equations given by the partial derivative of f with respect to x equal to zero and the partial derivative of f with respect to y equal to zero. And this is equivalent to y minus eight over x squared equal to zero and x minus eight over y squared equal to zero. From this relation, we get that y is eight over x squared and x is equal to eight over y squared. But this means that x squared y equals eight and similarly y squared x equal to eight x over y equal to one, so x must be equal to y. And from this relation, we get that x to the power three equal to eight, x must be real, so means that x is equal to two, and this is also equal to y. So the point A having the coordinates two, two, is the only critical point. In the second part of solving this problem, we will check if the Hessian of f at the point A is or not positive definite or negative definite or undefinite. For this, we compute the second order partial derivatives of f. So the second order partial derivative of f with respect to x equals 16 over x to the power 3. The second order derivative of f with respect to y is equal to 16 over y to the power 3. And the mixed derivatives of order 2 of the function f are both equal to 1. So the Hessian of f at an arbitrary point x, y equals 16 over x to the power 3, 16 over y to the power 3, 1, 1. Computing the Hessian at the point A, we find the matrix. 2, 1, 1, 2. And for instance, using the Jacobi standard procedure to see if this matrix is positive definite, we have delta 0 equal to 1, delta 1 equal to the determinant of this element is exactly the element is 2, and delta 2, the determinant of the matrix, of the Hessian matrix, and this is three. Since all three deltas are positive, it means that the Hessian of F at the critical point A is positive definite. And in this case, we know from theory that A is a local minimum for the function F. And since A is the only critical point, it means that the solution is now complete.